BMARC empowers users in two main areas, access to data and predictive benchmarking. BMARC was born out of the common problem of spending too much time finding data and not enough time using data. BMARC now provides over 50,000 fields and reservoirs around the world and analytical tools to use this data. Second aspect brings together supervised machine learning and our knowledge of the subsurface to allow users to maximize the value of their portfolio or of their asset. The biggest challenge in BMARC's development is the same pain point that we're trying to fix for users, finding data. The global database in BMARC is the result of over 10 years of hard work by our great team of data analysts, but we're always going to be constrained by what's available in the public domain. In reality, BMARC has been constantly evolving since its release in 2015, with new data types and new analytics being added since then. But just now is a really exciting time in the development of BMARC. We're adding a host of new energy transition technologies to BMARC, initially focused on carbon capture and storage, with new data sets and workflows allowing users to screen sites for their CCS potential. After this, we'll move into other energy transition technologies overall creating a multi-energy portfolio analysis tool.